Hi, welcome to my Unreal Engine tutorial today. What I'm going to be showing you how to do is smooth out the locomotion or movement of your character with things like FOV sliding and just overall ramp up of speed versus being immediate. So right now, this is what it looks like. As you can see, we immediately go to running. Like we immediately go to full speed. I think it might take like half a second, but we immediately go there. There's no sense of speed or anything. He's just running and the camera's static. So we're going to fix that real quick. Okay, so the first thing I did was I created two custom events, one for 90 FOB and one for 110 FOB. You can make these whichever ones you want for your project. If you want 100 FOB and 120 or whatever, you can do that. I just found these work best. Okay, and then we need event tick. And then we also need our move forward and move right over here. So let's go ahead and get started with the FOB. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to set field of view, follow camera, Okay, I'm going to copy paste this, all right, and we're going to connect them up. And then for the in field of view, we're going to get f interp 2. Our current is going to be get field of view, where is it? follow camera, get field of view. Okay, that's our current. Our target's going to be 90. Our get delta time is going to be get, get world delta seconds. Okay, and then our interp speed, we're gonna do 2.0. The lower you go, so if it's fractions, like decimals, it'll be really small. If it's higher whole numbers, it'll be really fast in terms of smoothness. Okay, so I'm gonna do 2.0, and then I'm going to connect this, or copy paste it, and I'm going to bring it up to here. So I'm gonna change this to 110, okay? And now, next thing we need to do is we need to go here, and I made this float variable, it's just an empty float, and it's called target walk speed. I'm gonna set this right here. Okay, I'm gonna set this to 800. All right, 800. And then um, that'll be that. Now I do recommend that you, um, whenever you, if you have sprinting, to when you're done sprinting, set this back down to like walking speed or something. Um, but I don't have sprinting, this is just normal movement. Okay, so with that said, let's get into the tick part of it where we actually set up the logic of how to like make it work. So we're gonna do off the first sequence, we're gonna do a branch, okay? And in this branch, we're gonna get velocity, get velocity of the character. And this is setting the field of view. So we're checking to make sure they're at a certain speed before we do that, okay? So we get the velocity and then we get the length of it, the vector length, all right? And then what we wanna do is we wanna get a greater, greater or equal to node. And it's gonna be 600 because my max walk speed is 800, okay? And I wanna make sure that if I'm at 600, it opens the field of view. All right, so that way it's not, you know, it's not messing with the field of view at like just idle or walking speed. Um, you can do that, but I'm not going to be doing that. Okay, so on true, we're going to get 110 FOV. We're going to set to 110 FOV and 90 FOV for the false. Okay, so if we're above 600 walk speed, we go to 110 FOV. If we're not, we go to 90 FOV. Now, I don't recommend putting this on tick for your um, final game. I recommend putting it on the timeline or C++, but you don't have to do C++. A timeline will work just fine. Okay, and then the final thing that we need to do is we need to set the walk speed. So we are going to get the set max walk speed. Uh, we're going to get the character movement. Okay, so character movement, set max walk speed. All right, so we have that. We're going to connect that up. And then off here, we're going to do another F interp 2. All right. And we're going to get the current walk speed, the get max walk speed, which is what it will currently be. All right. And then for the target, we're going to get the target walk speed that we set down here, right over here. Okay. And then what we need to do is get world delta seconds. All right, and then we need to set this. I'm going to do like 0 0.5. I don't know how fast or slow that's going to be, but we'll we'll check that. So now what we're going to do is this: we're going to play it, but this is going to set the field of view smoothly, and this is going to interpolate between the max walk speed. Okay, that's how that works. So now let's test it. So as you can see, there's a slight like ramp up, right? He doesn't immediately go. Now it does work better if you have sprinting and walking. 
but you can definitely see the ramp up. The field of view changes. It also works with jumping, so that's really cool. But that's basically how you make smooth locomotion. If you like this video, hit the like button and the subscribe. Thank you for watching. Have a good one.